It was a decision here at Westminster Magistrates Court which has left Rwanda's top spy chief now free to return to the country. Just to recap, General Kareki was arrested at London's Heathrow Airport back in June under a warrant issued by Spain. They wanted him extradited to the country to stand trial for a number of charges, including genocide, crimes against humanity and terrorism, including uh, the killing of a number of Spanish aid workers back in 1997. General Karaki was bailed uh, shortly after an initial hearing uh, for an amount we understand to be uh, around 20 million rand. There were other provisions as part of his bail conditions, including the surrender of his own passport. But on Monday afternoon, uh, there was a hearing here at the court uh, where the Foreign Office tell me that the case was dropped under a technical clause in the extradition proceedings uh, known as dual criminality. Essentially, uh, the clause that the country extraditing the UK must recognise the charges uh, which stand in Spain. And now it's understood now that uh, General Karaki is free to return to the country and the news has certainly been welcomed by Rwandan officials both here in the UK and back in Rwanda. The country's foreign minister saying that she is delighted that he is coming home, uh, describing this as an unnecessary and abusive process. It has certainly been a strain on relations between uh, Rwanda and the United Kingdom and it's hoped that this decision in the court may well repair those relations. Dan Whitehead, SABC News at Westminster Magistrates Court in London.